so uh, we would be learning lattice dynamics and what is that now it's the vibration of the lattice about their mean position by virtue of the temperature meaning jehetu ambient temperature ache those atoms which are sitting at the lattice point they cannot be thought of as rigidly fixed and they can uh, vibrate about their mean position and the vibration is so small or the corresponding frequency is such that you can assume that in comparison to the electronic vibration this ions are stationary the kinetic approximation bola hai but still you can talk of something like the quantization of lattice vibration and there are certain phenomena which uh, which provides experimental proof of the presence of lattice vibration and the experimental phenomena flow dekhte ho so before i really do that let me just give you an brief idea about the uh, since uh, in our last class after doing certain amount of mathematics for monatomic chain and then for diatomic chain we came to know that uh, there could exist two kind of branches optical branch and acoustic branch and there is a kind of enumeration of this branches photoglo optical branch karte pare photoglo acoustical branch karte pare and so on we would slightly uh, want to have an idea about the number of the uh, branches prothom je photoglo karte prothom kotha hocche je jodi mono atomic na hoy diatomic hoy tahole keu eta khub shohojei bole dite pare from the very basic point of view acoustic se sei problem theke je dukhana dispersion relation establish kore jabe karon omega square se 1 by m1 plus 1 by n then three dimensional set of atoms that are real crystal exist for it then you have to take into account the price and degrees of freedom for the number of atoms and per atom there is three degree of freedom so price and degree of freedom only there could be price and number of three number of acoustic branches and price and minus three number of uh, uh, optical branches So, uh, let me just uh, and one more thing you need to know is that there could be longitudinal optical branch and transverse optical branch and there could be longitudinal acoustic branch and transverse acoustic branch. So you can have L A P A. So these are longitudinal acoustic. For 
एग्जांपल यू कैन हैव एफसीसी लैटिस यू कैन हैव इफ यू ड्रॉ ए प्रिमिटिव सेल देन प्रिमिटिव सेल मैंने वो एक पूरा क्यूब टेक लिख के रखा था और पूरा मैंने लिख दिया सो टू एटम्स फॉर यूनिट सेल फॉर डायमंड स्ट्रक्चर एज वेल एज फॉर सोडियम क्लोराइड स्ट्रक्चर इट इज टू एटम्स सो इफ आई अज्यूम देयर आर टी एटम्स फॉर प्रिमिटिव सेल and uh, n primitive cells total uh oi solid er modhe jodi n somvo primitive cell thake tahole there would be total number of atoms tale koto hocche na pn number of atoms so in three dimension you have this many number of atoms pn number of atoms mane this could be Rise pn degree of freedom. Obviously, for each atom there is three degrees of freedom. So, rise pn degree of freedom. And now, if I ask, J, what would be the number of k values in single branch? Number of k values in a single branch. That would be equal to n. Obviously, for one will be also. Okay. And now, uh, what uh, we are going to do is, if I if I do the calculation, n take two more. I am going to calculate the number. So, after that, we are going to do the calculation. The number of k values we are going to do is a particular branch. We are going to do the नंबर ऑफ प्रिमिटिव सेल आज से इतना हम मैथमेटिकली प्रमाण करते पार हुए तो कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ वही जैसे टोटल लैटिस ये हम लेंगे वगैरह तो भी तो टू टाइप बा ऐसे करके बोला हो जाए एक है जो कैमरे एक होगे ना कितने बोले नीचे हम लोग आपका नाम है वन की इन बाइस बाइ ए 
এটা হচ্ছে প্রিমিটিভ সেলে বলে তাহলে নিশ্চয়ই এর সংখ্যক প্রিমিটিভ সেল দিয়ে পুরো ক্রিস্টালটা তৈরি হয়েছে বিকজ देयर আর এন অ্যাটমস বা পি এন অ্যাটম বলে পি এন টু এটা ওকে মানে এটা এন বলছি বা এটা পি এন হতে পারে তো যদি এক একটা প্রিমিটিভ সেলে এটা এটা আমি ধরে নিয়েছি যে ওয়ান অ্যাটম Why we are actually writing this as the number of k values in a single branch. So if that is equal to n, then we can write uh, uh, one longitudinal zone thus given a multiple thus one la and two uh, uh, ta. Okay. When I am writing the acoustic mode, I should. this as optical one and uh, to the 
किंतु अगेन लेट मी टेल यू दिस इज नथिंग टू डू विथ एक्चुअल इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक और ऑप्टिकल थिंग ओनली थिंग इज देयर से ओदेर मोड ऑफ ऑसिलेशन को एरर को होते पारे अथवा जेटा एटमॉस्फेरिक एंट्रेंट का है शेयर को होते पारे जेटा में
another sheet of code. What is the impact of an harmonic tone? Right now, when we derive this relation, we can find our force expression only harmonic tone. In fact, we will do astronomical level chapter and now that we put a lecture as a classical harmonic approximation. It has to do with the electrons one only chapter to be done, but when it is done, it is a harmonic approximation. Because it is a harmonic approximation. ताहले इधर जो दिल्ली की ये बारे जो दिल्ली हमें statistical physics का जो लगा है, so we know that the partition function is z is equal to p plus summation canonical partition function e to the power minus beta epsilon n, so this is going to give us e to the power minus beta n plus half h cross omega, so this was e to the power minus beta h cross omega by e to the common a to the power minus beta n h cross omega. So this is summation over n. So this would be um, 1 by 1 minus e to the power beta h cross omega. This is a geometric series. In a root summation. Thank you. 
actually are bosons. Okay. So once it, once we know that that these are bosons, so phonons are nothing but they are they are bosons. So if they are bosons, then the point first time we put the onyx solid wedge. We know the distribution function, how they can be distributed among the different energy levels, and now we could try to predict the different property. The first thermal property is nothing but the specific heat, specific heat at constant volume. How much heat can a solid hold if you provide it from outside a certain amount of heat? अपने सर हीट कैपेसिटी को तो जो कॉपर का हीट के बुरे रखते पारे एंड दैट्स व्हाट वी वुड ट्राई टू इवेलुएट फ्रॉम हियर ये प्रथम जेटा सोचनी बोला जाए ये व्हाट वुड बी द टोटल एनर्जी स्टैटिस्टिकली हाउ वुड वन गेट एन एक्सप्रेशन फॉर द टोटल एनर्जी नाउ वी हैव द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन फंक्शन टू ब
पर b का x क्रॉस होके का माइनस वन b b ओमेगा t ओमेगा इस का डेंसिटी ऑफ स्पेस d o s इन द फ्रीक्वेंसी रेंज ओमेगा एंड ओमेगा प्लस b ओमेगा सो वन कैन ऑलवेज ट्रांसफॉर्म दिस समेशन इनटू एक कंटिन्यूअम वेरिएशन ऑफ फ्रीक्वेंसी एवं हमारे पूर्व उद्देश्य वे इधर दिखे प्रथम में ही डेंसिटी ऑफ स्टेट्स का इवैल्यूएट हुआ आइंस्टीन को बुद्धिमान चीन उन्हें प्रथम में ही बोल लें आइंस्टीन स्थिति की उनका पूरे जो है तो शिका हम लोग शिका ही आरेख बार देखें नीचे जे आइंस्टीन स्थिति लगते जे एन हार्मोनिक ऑसिलेटर्स
by y square q along values of k per unit volume. मैंने volume one इटा के one को लेके ले d k d ये हो गए and that that is equal to it is equal to कौन सा ना b by k by q this is the value of so what would be the total number of nodes total number of nodes na number of allowed keys multiplied by the volume occupied by the key in a in a uniform sphere total number of nodes
Hence the total number of acoustic phonon phonon of equities and classes of the derived currency that you see in the primitive cell by acoustic phonon mode. So, in time of it, in so uh, we can have an upper limit of the frequency. Uh, we can always derive the expression for uh, omega d. Okay. Omega d q would be equal to 6 pi square d q n by v. What are we going to do? Now this is coming from the expression of k is equal to the uh, you can just substitute this omega omega by k is equal to omega by v but then you have a upper limit of the frequency and uh, upper limit of the of the wave number current a conjunct of linear relation of a conjunct there is a limit right a limited beyond a value you don't have so if you put an upper limit then you invert this then you have an expression a conjunct camera omega omega t to the right yeah? expression may continue एबारे यही ओमेगा टी जो भी अपर लिमिट है वो ये बोलते हैं समस्त एक्वास्टिक फोनों को के अकाउंट पे दिए में आ गए क्या ना बोलते हैं जो समस्त एक्वास्टिक फोनों का रूप डिग्री ऑफ़ फ्रीडम ये बाहर या एक्सोस्ट कर जाता है तो डिग्री ऑफ़ फ्रीडम नहीं जाते करे भी लैबिस का ऑसिलेट Then we can always write the corresponding thermal energy associated to be u, which is equal to proton b omega b omega uh, and uh, h cross omega by to the power h cross omega beta minus one. The layer diagram, right? We can substitute for it. If we substitute omega square by twice pi square v q and we integrate this only to the upper limit of the frequency 0 to omega t and not beyond that. Amra Gunchi, Chi Joto thermal energy crystal ache due to the vibration of the acoustic phonons. Shekhto rectum maximum limit ache. J limited mode dispersion relation per linear. J limited mode velocity ka constant. Digai time mein ko. Jee ko taate kure ko. J expression for the specific heat power. Jee ko just hamra ek ek ko substitute kore. Ko ekhen aro ek ka digai ye ko question aur chhe jee assume phonon velocity. for all polarization and the income acoustic phone on the and multiply the above expression by 3 the repeated degree of freedom is you know the degree of freedom is you know the degree of freedom is you know the degree of freedom
can extend this uh, well, energy per u total is u total is this is this so one can very easily calculate the corresponding specific heat you can see the temperature is operating in the fourth power apart from a very slowly varying exponential factor in the denominator which is a divine function which is a very important function in fact, the fact that the x d the h cross omega d the omega d is a very important function omega d is also now omega d is a uh, uh, 6 uh, pi square uh, n power 1 third and uh, v omega d by e. so uh, uh, where n is the number density so uh, n power of the power of the power so uh, if varpa protect our opinion So, uh, if one substitute this expression over here, x d is shown in the paper, one can define the corresponding temperature as the divide temperature. Okay? One can define a variable called uh, x d equal to theta d by t, which is equal to which, uh, h cross omega d by k b and uh, a a x d derivative where theta d is h cross omega d by k b now only omega d also now omega d is h cross d by k b or uh, 6 pi square the number of the primitive cells, the total volume, the velocity, acoustic velocity, that can be very easily measured by sending certain uh, ultrasonic waves, you can always measure this. And then you can define a very important physical parameter which is known as the divide temperature and you can express the total energy and the specific heat. You can even express this. You can always write this to be 9 n k t t by t 30 
after all this lattice vibrations are the actual cause or the reason behind the specific heat or thermal heat capacity of the solids and they can be uh, uh, mathematically calculated by assuming that the vibrations are quantized this elastic vibration among the lattice is quantized and the quanta particle the quantum of this vibration actually are zonic in nature and if you assume the total energy and calculate the density of the states put them accordingly with their upper limit in the frequency of oscillation because one cannot say that say you can go up to infinity right mane kyu omega ke infinity bolu to niye na mane shekhane omega versus eta constant but when eta given ya to ho jayega nahi so if i put an upper limit which is called as omega t je a frequency bolto hai we would get a constant acoustic velocity to check up pure amra ekta reasonably experimentally agreeable result in the culture so that that was the message which i want to give you and everything of this every bit of this you can find in any of the book of charles kinnell or is go to that kotha kon calculation oshubidha hole obosshoi thank you